Hello everyone. My name is Vaibhav Wadekar. I am Lead Tech Support Analyst here at BMC Software. Today, I'm going to show you how to add Owner Group, which is a dynamic menu field within Smart IT Views. You can refer the online documentation from which I followed the steps for this video tutorial. So within Smart IT, if you are an administrator, you can add one or more dynamic menu fields that have menus associated with it and you can configure the menu fields on the universal client using the screens configuration option. At runtime, these menus will be available on all clients. When I say all clients, it includes universal client, mobile client. So before we go further, uh, we need to make sure that for owner group dynamic field, there are four fields that we have to expose. We have to expose those four fields within the forms. So as you can see on my screen, I log into Developer Studio, and first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to create an overlay for all those four forms. So uh, I created a overlay, a form overlay, and view overlay of these four forms. And the first step I'm going to do with the HPD help desk, uh, the fields are not in view, so I'm just going to add those fields in the view. So here I can see uh, the owner support company and owner support organization has been added. So after adding the fields in the view, that I align those fields here. Now let's go back to the second steps to add those four fields into the HPD incident interface underscore create. So in second step, you can see that we have created four fields, owner support company, support organization, owner group, owner. I copied, I made sure the database uh, ID is same and the name is same as opposed as uh, similar to HPD help desk. Uh, the third step is to add this field into HPD incident interface, uh, which is a joint form. As you can see that within HPD incident interface, we have added those four fields like add field from HPD help desk and make sure that their database ID and name is same for all those four fields. Let's see the fourth step of adding those fields into the SLM outer join. So within uh, the HPD help desk SLM join outer, we see that those fields are there already. So we don't have to do much stuff here. Once you add all those fields on the respective forms, you come back to the Smart IT Universal Client uh, and log in with as administrator. Within configuration section uh, and the additional info, go ahead and add those four fields. Owner support company, owner support organization, owner group. So within owner group, make sure that you select populate value a different field, owner group ID. And for the owner field, uh, make sure that you select populate value a different field, owner login ID save this and then click on refresh metadata and let's go ahead and create an incident in progress and here are our four fields that we added so the calbro services it support service desk These are the steps needed to configure owner group menu field within Smart IT Views. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video.